Whiteboard animations are fun, attractive, and really helpful for explainer videos. It makes a complex message so easy to understand as if you're telling a story to children, who, as we all know, have very short attention span. Today, we're going to be comparing two whiteboard animation software in terms of its ease of use, pricing, and effectiveness. If you're undecided which one to pick, I hope this video will be very helpful to you. So I'm going to go ahead and flash the screens. When you first open their timelines, they're all in white background. Except, of course, if you choose other set of video templates for Beyond, there will be some others. But just we will focus on the whiteboard for now. Doodly has this very, very simple look, and I find it very close to Emma's board older version, whereas Beyond's platform has a fresh new look, but also simple, like the latest MS PowerPoint. Overall, both of them are not intimidating to look at. They both give me the feeling that their timeline is easy to use and I won't have any problems in my editing process. Characters, props, and so on, for Beyond and Doodly, all elements can be found on the left side of the screen. They have a search bar at the top so you can easily type in what you need and it will show. Beyond has more elements to offer compared to Doodly, and I love that it is sorted into categories. When it comes to animations, Beyond also has more to offer. The characters themselves are moving, and you can even add to the motions of your elements. And what I really love is the camera movement. This really helps to create a more interactive storytelling or explainer video. Video. With Doodly, the animations are more focused in the drawing or scribbling of the elements. When moving from one scene to another, I like that they have the erasing transition. It really stands for its name, Doodly, in a way that whatever you see on your screen has something to do with Doodle or drawing as a whole. Doodly is very user-friendly, it is fast and efficient. Customizing the elements will not even take you a minute, especially if you're in a hurry. The scenes on the timeline can be dragged and adjusted. On its right side, everything is there and for any additional settings that you like to put onto your video. Beyond has some complications and will require a bit of your time to explore and find how exactly you will be able to customize your elements and make the most out of your platform. For example, you have to click the arrow under the video icon on the timeline for you to be able to adjust the length or duration of each element. Now that we've seen and tried some of the important parts when editing in this kind of software, I'm going to show you the look of our final output using the same concept, script, voiceover, music, and then of course from there, we will rate which animation software gets the highest votes. Whiteboard animations are fun, attractive, and really helpful for explainer videos. It makes a complex message so easy to understand as if you're telling a story to children, who, as we all know, have very short attention span. So, who should use whiteboard animations? It can be used by anyone who wants to inform or sell products in a much interactive way. These can be marketers, developers, educators, coaches, social media content creators, video editors or freelancers, and small business owners who need to save time and money. However, choosing the best whiteboard animation for your business can be a bit tricky. You have to consider whether it is user-friendly, is the software fast and efficient, or will take you days of training before you can produce a one-minute long explainer video. Is it budget-friendly, or outsourcing a freelancer would be far of better? Finally, do you love its overall presentation? If you have all the answers, waste no time and grab the most suitable whiteboard animation software. Need more help? Contact us! Whiteboard animations are fun, attractive, and really helpful for explainer videos. It makes a complex message so easy to understand as if you're telling a story to children, who, as we all know, have very short attention span. So, who should use whiteboard animations? It can be used by anyone who wants to inform or sell products in a much interactive way. These can be marketers, developers, educators, coaches, social media content creators, video editors or freelancers, and small business owners who need to save time and money. However, choosing the best whiteboard animation for your business can be a bit tricky. You have to consider whether it is user-friendly, is the software fast and efficient, or will take you days of training before you can produce a one-minute long explainer video. Is it budget-friendly, or outsourcing a freelancer would be far of better? Finally, do you love its overall presentation? If you have all the answers, waste no time and grab the most suitable whiteboard animation software. Need more help? Contact us!
my final thoughts on Dudley and Beyond in terms of its ease of use. Overall, both of them are not too complex. You can easily find your way to what you need and learn through the editing process. There are only some areas in Beyond where you may get stuck. I kind of had a bit of trouble adjusting the camera movements in the beginning. And as I mentioned, syncing the duration of the elements to my voiceover requires some time as you need to adjust each on the timeline. So my vote in this goes to Dudley. Doodly has a lifetime $67 deal, Beyond only has a subscription plan. There is a free 40-day trial with Beyond, Doodly has 30-day money-back guarantee. Honestly, I love lifetime deals and you know that it's like my weakness. Whenever there's a video software and it has a one-time payment promo, I usually just go ahead and purchase to try it. However, if you're an agency and you can invest on a subscription plan, Beyond is a really good option to go for. It has all kinds of animations, not just whiteboard, and there are tons of templates that you can definitely Used for different industries. Doodly also has its annual plan, and if you compare the monthly payment, they're just basically the same. The only advantage Doodly has in this is its one-time payment license, which is good enough for freelancers or small business owners who do not require much complication in their animations. So again, my vote goes to Doodly. As for the overall presentation, I really like Beyond more. The illustrations look more attractive and I love that there are built-in animations in them. It makes the video look livelier and interactive. Their templates also give you design ideas which you can customize, of course. It helps you save time in a way that you don't need to start from the scratch. But if you're gonna look at both of the videos again, from my point of view, both are so attractive to me because whiteboard animated video simply has that interesting look that makes people want to watch more or finish the video. And that's the end of our review. You can find more about Beyond and Doodly on my links below. If you think this video is helpful, give it a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button so you won't miss out an update.